Levier Fine Writing Instruments presents The Fabrication Process of a Bottle Stopper Using Firewood A video is available in how to turn firewood into bottle stopper blanks. What we are doing here is just mounting the bottle stopper blank and we are going to turn it in between centers. Marking the centers of the bottle stopper blank was not critical for this part of the process. We are going to clean the blank so we can assure that we have a correct cylindrical shape. Two tenons are going to be needed for the following process. They will provide a support area for the chuck. This final cut is just a cleaning process that we are doing. We need a flat surface because the cork is going to be facing this side. Using a 3.8 drill bit, we are going to drill a hole in the middle of the blank. It is important to clean the drill during the drilling process. The subassembly is now completed. Polyurethane glue was used to hold the dowel inside the blank. Now that we know the diameter of the cork, it is now time to start the design process. The first cuts that we are doing is just to reduce the diameter of the bottle stopper blank. The shape and size of our bottle stopper is going to be based upon our design. No bushings or specific dimensions are required. The tool that we are using now is a spindle gouge. Levier has a video in how to do a reshape of this tool. The video is available in YouTube, username Levier2011. Having a chart tool is a key element. Here we can see how the, um, the surface that we are leaving is almost perfect and minimal sanding will be required. A collet chalk. For this particular project we have to be very careful because it is going to be uh, suspended or held in a piece of wood or just a dowel. High pressures are going to be applied to the dowel not only from the chalk but also for the cutting tool. Our design of the bottle stopper is now taking shape. It only takes a fraction of a second for an accident or in this case a disaster. In this particular case it was just a matter of changing the, the bottle stopper blank and try again. We can never say never. The benefit of making the tenon is now seen. The blank is being held by the jaws of the chuck in a surface that is more stronger and definitely can take the beating of the tools. One thing that I like about the bottle stoppers is that uh, creativity is the key element for our design. 
Now we are using a half inch skew. Here our bottle stopper is now taking shape, square and round shapes. Here we can see that the tool location was the improper one. That is the reason that we had this catch. A redesign is the only thing needed to fix this bottle stop. Here I'm just adding the final details to the bottle stop. The cutting process is now completed, so it is time now to sand the blank. The finish that we are applying is a high gloss polyurethane. The application of this finish can be made with a paper towel or a foam brush. After two incidents, we have a finished bottle stopper. Never give up. If you have any questions, comments or concerns in regards to this video, feel free to send me an email. I will reply it as soon as possible. Thank you.